Trust the Profits Breeders Cup coverage is brought to you by Play Up Racebook, the most horse player friendly racebook in the industry. Play Up Racebook is always your best bet. What's up, everybody? I'm Colin Sheen. Welcome to Trust the Profits YouTube page and the Breeders Cup Spotlight series where we are highlighting all of the main contenders for Breeders Cup weekend. Today, we're going to the two year old Phillies on the dirt. Looking at the past performances courtesy of Brisnet.com. Check the link below. Today we're looking at Chop Chop, who's trained by Brad Cox. And the interesting thing about Chop Chop is her first two races were on the turf. And she did very well on the turf. For Brad Cox to move to the dirt hopefully means that he sees that this horse can be successful. And on October 7th, she tried the dirt over at Keeneland, finishing second to Wonder Wheel, who's another contender in this race coming from way off the pace. You'll notice this bad start started. 11th place, six lengths behind. Trainer Brad Cox said that uh, sometimes that first time out of the gate on the dirt, getting kicked back, may not have been something she liked. And he also thought that she was affected by the short stretch at Keeneland. The Breeders' Cup is at Keeneland, so something you want to pay attention to. But showed that she can handle the mile on the 16th very well. You look at the Dam Sire's average winning distance of 8.1. Makes you think that she's not going to have any problem handling it. Also by the sire of City Light, who has come on fire lately with a lot of success. Chop Chop is also your prime power first using Brisnet prime power if you use that with Wonder Wheel second. Chop Chop going to be a legit contender for the Breeder Cup Juvenile Phillies.